Well, I'm fresh off the American Boiler Manufacturers Association conference, and in that conference, they talk a lot about NFPA 85. I thought it'd be great to go into our training container, be with Mike Taylor, and talk a little bit about the NFPA 85 and some codes that maybe you're not doing. Welcome to The Boiling Point. I'm with Michael Taylor, our resident expert and all of his knowledge. And we're back in uh, our training container. We're very fortunate to have this where we actually train our technicians. Uh, Michael spends a lot of time with technicians and even into our uh, uh, contractors that he brings in and really teaches them about boilers. Fresh off the American Boiler Manufacturers Association, as I said, we're talking about NFPA 85. I went to Michael and I said, um, Michael, what are some of the common things that people are not doing that's according to the code and he actually talked a little bit about gas trains and venting so he's going to point that out for us today. Michael why don't you take us through it. Okay on the gas train typically you're going to have two different kinds of vents. One is a power vent off the vent valves mm -hmm. and another is the vents off of regulators and gas pressure switches. Okay. And the code says you can't tie the two of those together. Okay. They have to be run out separate, as these are. Here's the vent valve, here's the vent off the regulator. Okay. But it also says you can't combine vents off of two different boilers. Okay. So each boiler has to have its own vents going out. There's a lot of old boiler rooms out there that before that code was ever put into place, they just tied everything together, one vent going out of the boiler room with four boilers, and it's never been changed. Okay. So they're not code. So if they have multiple boilers, one, two, three, they can't all come off and then go into a single vent. Everything no. has to go out separately. Everything has to go out separately. Okay. All right. Well, there you have it. It's quick this week, but uh, we're something that we're going to be going through is some of the NFP 85 common mistakes that maybe folks are making in boiler rooms. We'll see you next time on The Boiling Point. Well, appreciate Michael stopping by and talking with us as always. If you haven't checked out the American Boiler Manufacturers Association, you can check their website right here. A great organization and we get a lot of tips and information from them. Well, make sure you like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. And if you don't mind, share the videos. And we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point.